Welcome back everyone, Jason here, and as you can see, it's day 84, which means another Horde Night. Now, for the past six days, I've been doing a lot of uh, tedious work. Now, I did go and visit the traders multiple times, but it really wasn't worth making episodes on them. Especially, you know, two episodes back to back and nothing but just going to traders is redundant and boring. Although, one of the Bobs did have a seizure, some kind of fit at one point, but, yeah. I figured I would just do all the grinding and all the hard work and then just bring it up to date. Now, as you can see, now as far as the traders go, I will say um, I haven't visited them in a couple days now. I'm waiting for them to restock and I'm hoping that by avoiding them for a while... Their stock improves because reinforced steel upgrade was getting ridiculous. It was just nickel and diming. I'd go and they might have like seven, uh, 17, and I think Trader Rec had 40. It was like the highlight. Uh, but what I did get, I mean, I still have just slightly under a full stack, to, you know, of it left. But as you can see, I was able to do all the windowsills on the front of the hotel. Of course, I still have a lot of uh, little minor details to do, but now my trees are up. So yeah, it's coming along quite nicely, if you ask, you know, in my opinion anyway. Now the, who the biggest grind out of it all was my moat. It is now 100% completely hollowed out. Of course, wood frames still exist on the top because I literally ran out of resources. I ran out of raw iron. I damn near ran out of small stone. I ran out of sand. I ran out of all my concrete that I had. And, of course, you know, between this project and redoing the damn horde base, that was kind of to be expected. Uh, you can actually see where I, <laughs> I ran out of concrete when I was down here. Uh, and I still have to pave the entire floor. But yeah, this whole thing now is 100% hollowed out. Now, I'm not going to go extreme with the log spikes. I'll put like maybe two rolls on the walls and that's it. Uh, but as you see, I mean, that's still going to be a lot of shit to do. And I mean, I, I threw little things here and there, you know. I got my uh, little church fuse out here. And then come in here. Of course, I did what I was going to say. I replaced that with redwood and, of course, put a little seating area. But it's not like I had any time to actually work on any of the rooms in here uh, and focus on anything. And, of course, when it snows, you know, this all turns pure white. But that's just going to have to be until I get all the... At least the main center completely done, and then I'll fuck with those glass panes. And hopefully, you know, force it to stop uh, snowing inside. So. You know. The, the worst part was actually, yeah, going through and redigging out that whole moat. Now, I did pull out my auger. Oh, I burned through a whole lot of gas. Whew, and a lot of repair kits, so... Yeah, now my oil situation is low. I still got plenty of oil shale, but, you know... Still took quite a few, uh... Quite a bit of gas. Like, at least 8,000, I think. Somewhere around there. And, of course, I'm nowhere near being completed. Because even after the moat's done, there's still going to be a wall up here. Now, how high... How you know, how high the wall's going to be is not going to be too high. Obviously, I don't want it to interfere with the windows on that first, uh, on the first floor in the hotel. But yeah. And then we come down here. So far, so good. Knock on wood. I've had no crashes. I do have to remove those lights, though. And, of course, I'm making more gunpowder. And I did finish this. I was going to get a little fancy. 
But I figured this this would suffice right here. And I got a place for pistols, magnums, rifles, automatics, shotguns, and then uh, rocket launcher and crossbow. But just a just something for a little flavor. Because I really did think about going in and then cutting in and opening it up, but didn't really need to do it, you know, overkill. As you see, I'm making two more things, but yeah. Yeah, I had, oh hell, I might have had, no, I think I had five rolls of concrete, if not almost six. Uh, but yeah, I am now completely bone dry. Now, yesterday I did spend the whole day and I literally just went northeast or west and I destroyed every boulder in this region here. So I did get some, you know, I did get some uh, raw iron back. Four, of the, uh, four stacks did go into the forges. Uh, small stone, as you can see, is going down. Sand is in critical condition. I, I'm good on clay for the moment, but if I need to make more um, flagstone blocks, that's not going to last. So I do need to spend time getting clay. Uh, brass wasn't too bad. I made like a 4,000 stack from crushing boulders, but I did smelt uh, the majority of it down because I need to make more bullet uh, tips and casings. So yeah, mm -hmm. That is currently where my stock is. Cool. Let's go ahead and... Refill everything up. That one's done, and that means that that one's done. <laughs> well, actually, you know what? I'm going to take that back upstairs. Ooh, it is getting dark. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Yeah, Horde Knight, I'm being a jackass here. That is so bright. But, at least it is coming along. Uh, that is legitly <laughs> all that I have left. And surprisingly, even though it was nickel diming everything, I actually did make quite a bit. Oh, there's my workbench. I was figuring where the hell was it the last time I was at my my horde base, and sure enough, it I had to store it over here. Ooh, it is good old blood moon. Oh yeah. Now, of course, I do have to do a lot of touch up, and I have to do a lot of grinding still. You know, that, that concrete that I made, that's not going to last long. So I really do need to focus on mining. So I might do that for a couple days. I do need to start going back to the traders. Because let's face it, I need to have a reinforced steel upgrade in order to complete that hotel. Now, obviously, I didn't come over here and do anything. I did mess with the farming a little bit, but that's about it. Of course, I will keep that there because I don't trust anything. Now, so, <laughs> now go figure. One of these plants is not growing. You know, seven days to glitch. Just gonna slap you. Yeah, we'll just slap you there. Oh well, I guess I could have used concrete. Make 
sure everything's reloaded. And I believe I am well equipped for the night. So yeah, again, like I said, um, who that was a lot of work. Uh, very, very um, boring, obviously, but again, the end result justifies the means. I didn't show the I didn't show the um crate of all the snowballs that I've made. Uh what is it? Eight rolls across, I believe. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Uh if I open the chest, I have seven full stacks of snowballs and almost a complete one, I believe, or halfway of an eight stack. And that was just from digging the moat. That's not what I originally had already in my box. I didn't combine them. So, yeah, I mean, water situation. <laughs> I got snowballs for free infinity. Let's see. Um, And just regular catching up. Like I said, I need to do a lot more grinding. I'm... You've seen my small stone is completely critical. Uh, sand is obsolete. Thankfully, I do have a little bit of concrete done now. Of course, I sacrificed uh, a lot of my sm small stone that I did get from crushing boulders. So, at least in between the next couple of days, uh, I do need to spend a couple nights at least mining. And then, I, like I said, I believe Traders Reset on day 85. So I think after tonight, I will go ahead and visit the Traders. And if not, uh, that day, I'll wait till they, you know, one of the days in between. Because I am now in that mindset of where I need to get, uh, I need to get in the habit of visiting the Traders every restock. It's just that I don't want to create a filler episode where it's constantly me going to the traders. Oh, and I even took down the two boulders that were in the distance. So, let's see if the jackasses find another one. And unfortunately, I did not... Um, put lights up. So that is my own fault. Ooh. And of course, it's not like I have challenges, so. Damn, they all turn it into fidget spinners. You didn't really need your head, did you? Sorry, Sylvia. Yeah, stun damage. Your fucking head exploded, girl. I'm pretty sure that's about as stunned as you can get. Ah, uh, let's see. Now that's like, I really don't care for the stairs. But of course, it's not like I had the, the time or the resources, because it took, ooh, it took a long, 
quite a bit, at, you know, to dig out that moat. Even with, even with using the auger. Now, don't get me wrong; it definitely was a lot quicker. Um, but it was still time-consuming. You just sit there. You just sit there. Shoot you in the ass, man. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, sorry, 4130. I meant to. Yeah, I'm not shooting that through it. Now what I did mean to do was actually bring some steel, repair what damage happened to the uh, to the log spikes. Because I mean, there was obviously some damage. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry, love. Shoot that mother in the butt. Sit your ass down, bro. But again, that actually really kind of pisses me off that they, uh, once again, spawned in this direction. down there. Nope. Oh, oh. Cousin Blast. Now, of course, I am hoping that I don't blow myself up. Yep. Piss off, dog. Oh! Y'all are so angry! Of course, I am going to need to make more of the... More arrows because, yeah. The tower definitely gives me the ability to use it a lot more. Especially when they're bone rushing like that. Now that's impressive shit right there. Of course, I do need to bring some concrete over here. I don't think I have any in that box. Oh. Hey, you little bastard. Oh! Oh, damn, girl. Um, 
And you don't need your leg. But as I was saying with the stairs, sorry about that. Uh, sometimes it is hard to concentrate while you're sniping them. But the stairs, I knew I wasn't going to be a fan of the way that design was. Especially when the jackasses will go in there and hide. No, this is not dog. So that is... Now tell me if that ain't some weird shit right there. And then they're able to launch off that. Does that make any damn sense? Oh, son of a bitch. Okay, okay. Okay. Alright. Alright, No big deal. No big deal. <laughs> yeah, I see that dog coming. Yeah. Yeah, kiss my ass. Of course, I did get lucky. Actually, hey, you know what? Oh, get that damn thing out of there. A little bit of the ragdoll. A little bit of. No. Nope. Nope. I want you to stay over there. Holy shit! He's alive. No, nope. Ed. Shit. Get a bigger magazine for the damn sniper. But that is what's depressing. That's why I made the comment when I tore down the damn base. Uh, I knew the negative would be uh, the resources that I would lose. Because, yeah, having to, you know, redo all of it. Yeah, it was pretty damn costly. You know, I am in no position to now build another horde base of a different design. Let alone finish my damn moat. Which, don't get me wrong, uh, I think with, with what I've made, I actually should have enough. At least to finish the moat. So, that's a plus side. Of course, that doesn't negate the fact that... Wait a minute, that, that fucking dog? Piss off. Damn, how many fucking dogs? Oh! Yeah, sorry, Ash. Yeah, not today, bro. Shit. Wasn't fast enough. Uh, let's go ahead and repair that, though. And like I said, I mean, this is where the biggest problem is. So to be fair... You know, it's a matter of luck. You know, they didn't have to spawn in the same damn direction. This is your leg. Of course, even if I move here, it's not like they will run around. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yep. But my face. Should you 
in the air, bro. Fucking die. Now that's the part that actually gets me right there. I would not be opposed if the stairs broke down. No, that's on dog. No. Ooh, ooh, he's gonna need to see a crow after that one. Now, am I super worried about uh, my concrete and my resources being down? Of course not. A little bit of grinding. And all that will be rectified. But, of course, at the same time... Damn! I don't even know Aftershock on his ass. Oh, there he is. And again, no cops. Wow! But yeah, a little bit of effort and time and, you know, that's the best thing about the game. You know, you focus on your task at hand and, you know, you can accomplish quite a bit in a single day. You, it's just all about time management. That's the biggest thing. Sit down, Sylvia. Oh! Of course, I'm sitting here thinking about different horde base designs, and, you know, I still gotta get that damn base up and running. I would almost be tempted to put like a plate. Oh shit! I think they, yeah, look, yeah, they would finally bust one of them. I mean, good god, look at that shit! Oh god. 
god. I'm afraid that I'm gonna blow my damn self up. Yeah. Oh wow, I'm down to 40 rounds of that. Is that you think? Eh, okay. You tell me that motherfucker did not die. Good God. Now I know what I did notice after the last Horde night. One of these uh, steel spikes actually had quite a bit of damage. So I'm wondering if that's... Oh, shit! Okay, so, no. That is my fault for not, you know, repairing any of them. Dude, holy shit. <laughs> Fuck you, future girl. Nope. Fuck you all. Whoa! Nope. Nope. Oh, look it! Are you fucking kidding me? Dude! Finally, a fucking cop. Oh, um, and apparently I'm fucking damn near dehydrated. No, 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 no. Oh, fuck. Um, God, that that was fucking close. Oh shit. I should really learn to fill that with something that way I could just quick move it. Pissed me off even more. 
Ow, goddamn! <laughs> Fucking bitch! Fuck you. <laughs> oh, I hear another cop. Hoo hoo. Wait, is that him? Yeah, that was him. Hoo. Wow. <laughs> That's a little bit more drama than I. I originally bargained for? Uh, you just sit there, boy. Uh, now you tell me how that... That didn't fucking... That first shot missed him. Yeah, I'm tempted actually to put a, a lip. Just to see. Ooh. Man, that, that, that could have been bad so many damn times. Not only did I fall off once, uh, but then I dropped my damn sniper rifle. Is there some jackass over here? Oh, you are. Yeah, don't give a shit. Hey. What? The hell are you bitching about? <laughs> Motherfucker! What the fucking stop fucking breaking shit? Fucking assholes already. Now oh, fuck you. Get a like a three for one. Oh hell. And is that a shit, that's also a feral. Holy fuck. Yeah, tell me that ain't ridiculous. Okay, where'd he go? Oh! Okay, you sit there. Oh, no, that was a bad shot. Oh, fuck!
Well, possibility I'll actually make some weapons. Now that does remind me, I did make some decent dukes uh, from the treasure maps. Just like I said, I, I had 12. Holy crap. Oh. Uh, but they were from only two people, so yeah, I had to uh, damn near to uh, Nightfall to get the majority of them. I think I got 10 maps out of 12 uh, completed on the day. And, you know, I, I made like, I don't know, like 60, 63,000 uh, dukes out of that. Which is how I've been able to keep funding my stuff. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I felt like I have a lot of, uh, a lot of juice left. But I do have enough to continuously go to the traders. Oh, you got lucky. Nope. Son of a bitch! Is there any of them down there? Wait, did I just hear something break up? Oh, horse shit, man. Tell me that wasn't just bullshit right there. And that was the last one. Of those. Ah. I think I kind of want to install at the base level of it. There's some place for me to look through and actually snipe outward. Yeah, you know, when they hang up like that at the bottom. Because I know I'm doing a lot of damage by paying spraying like this. Which you wouldn't think I'm giving any damage, considering... It's all on bodies. Oh, oh, I think I see them. Fuck off! Good God! Future girl. I better eat a little bit. Try to regain some of my, um... 
Some of my help back. Wrong, bro. Now that's a lot of fucking carnage tonight. Wow. Nope, nope, nope. See, look at that bullshit. Now fuck off, future girl. Sorry, Sylvia. Holy hell! And of course, it's not like it's not like they're done. Yeah, you all like shit when you're walking. Fuck off! Wow! Holy shit! I brought a thousand rounds. I am down to 50 or 88 fucking rounds of the uh, 7.62. Holy shit! Okay, um, let us repair all this shit real quick. Oh, good god, dude. Fucking... Get over yourself. I have water here. Yeah, thank God. And you know what? Yeah, see, I even have a fucking stack of forged steel over here. But I don't have any... Well, okay, so I don't don't necessarily have any of the uh, concrete, which is to be expected, because like I said, I blew holy hell a lot. Okay. So, wow. <laughs> wow. I blew through a fucking, almost a thousand rounds. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's a lot of carnage. And what's the final kill? I'm up to 43.73. Oh, uh, when I was a jackass and forgot to look. And it was already at like... Now, you know damn well that was more than 100. That was probably more than 200. That was... A fucking massacre. So, okay. Do like I always do. Let me go ahead and clean all this bullshit up and uh, get back to you guys when uh, I'm done. Okay, so now that that's over with, as you can see, it's almost 6.30 in the morning. Uh, and this is what I got. So I did get a little bit of 9mm back. Uh, two pistols, saw a shotgun, and then look at this bullshit. Now, ooh, a level two for, you know, 44 Magna parts. And where's that sniper rifle? Yeah, sniper rifle part. A fucking level two. I mean, seriously. You know, walking vending machines, but then stupid shit like that. Just irks the living shit out of me. But, you know, all considering, not one fucking treasure map, again. But, eh. I don't know. 
Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Um, no. No. No! Yep. Bad zombie! No, y'all had your damn chance. Uh, no. Dude, you had your fucking chance. No. That's some damage when I blew your fucking nuts off. But I am turning them all into people glue, so... As I was saying, no treasure maps. Unless one of them pop. No. <sighs> All right. So looking at kills, holy shit, <laughs> forty-three seventy-nine. So yeah. And then, like I said. You know, and, you know, considering what all I've gotten. Oh, there is a military vest. But some really low, low shit. You know, they drop a 402 uh, magna parts. Not that I fucking need it. In fact, I really don't need any of those damn parts. But, for what it is, I guess it's not too, too bad. Thankfully, I have a workbench now, so I can combine a lot of this shit. Like, I mean, I'm not even going to bother. I'm just going to combine every every part and just go on with it. Now, as far as the rest of the day, I had ambitions of going to a trader. I think I will wait till tomorrow. So, what I'm just going to go ahead and do is take all the shit back to the base. And then probably just mine. For an entire day. Because I really need to just focus hardcore on resources and be done with it. Uh, like I said, you know. Because I got to repair all this shit. They did bust two of the uh, spikes. So there's one there. That one's actually damaged. I think that one was the one that was already damaged. And then they did get that one. Now, of course, me shooting sporadically like I did probably did more damage than they did, but at least I can repair that. That shouldn't take that long, and that should be pretty damn easy. So with that, hope you guys enjoyed. I didn't die, but <laughs> back to my old tactics of doing stupid shit on Horde Night. Oh, good God, that was... That was close, especially with my sniper rifle. But, like I, like I said, hit the like button if you liked it. Appreciate it. And, as always, take it easy, everyone. The atom bomb is now just glowing embers with every dawn I'm feeling stronger still. Despite the slow decay, it never goes away. The slow hypnotic, asymptotic slide toward letting go.